Alright, welcome back, I guess, to Stacklands. This... <laughs> holy cow, this game has taken so long to finish. I actually perfected this game quite a long time ago, and then recently the developers updated it with a bunch of new achievements. However, when I logged back on, I obtained over half of them already. So, I... <laughs> Quickly, last night, I logged back on, did a bunch of them, and now I've got two left. So I need to befriend a pirate and train an archer. Now, do I know how to do these quests? No, not at all. Okay, so to train an archer, I need one rope, one plank, and one wood. However, ropes can only be made out of cotton, which I need to go to the island for. We'll get to that in one second. Now, the next one is I need to befriend a pirate. So, to befriend a pirate, you need to give them a parrot. Parrots can be found in grilling and brewing packs. At the start of every moon, there's a chance a pirate boat appears. If you don't pay them, some pirates will spawn and attack your villagers. Make sure to save your game before the attack starts, since you might not be able to defeat all of them. However, it's not going to matter, because once I finish this game, I'm going to uninstall it. <laughs> again, I guess. I'm going to uninstall it again. First of all, we need to unpause. And we're going to use... which one? What do we use? The rowboat. No, we need the sloop. The sloop can carry up to 10 cards. So what we're going to do is bring a plank and wood. We'll chuck that on. Let's bring a bunch of you. And we're also going to need to bring... what? That's one, one, two, three, four, five, six cards, seven, eight cards. So we've got room for two more. So let's just bring two berries along. Two berry bushes along. It can't carry buildings. Yep, it did say that. Yep. Okay, two berries it is. Alright, so, we're going to travel over to the island now, to get the last two achievements. Yes, this will first end the current moon, and then feed all my villagers. So, we need food to feed all of our villagers. Holy cow, at the end of every moon. At the end of every day, we need to feed all our villagers to make sure they're okay. Holy cow, I forgot how much of a mess this place was. Um, okay, jeez. Uh... Give me a second, and I will try and figure out what the heck I'm doing here. How much gold do I have? 30. Nope, I've got 1700. Never mind. Even though it looks like I've got a lot of room, these cards, if they're not, like, if they don't stack against each other, they just, they just push off, and it's always in a random direction. It's, it's so frustrating. Because then, if, like, this stack gets really, really big, you go like this, and everything gets pushed out of the way. It's just so annoying, because my OCD kicks in, and I'm like, yeah, 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 this is going to be really, really good. Look at all this space I've got. And then I'm like, oh, no, everything needs to be, like, perfectly in its own spot. But then if I introduce, like, something like this, I can just screw up the entire thing. Oh. And it, it just takes forever to bring, get back, because, like, wait, does, does this go there? Just, hold on, you go there. No, you, well, hold on. See what I mean? <laughs> Okay, so, we need to go to the Grilling and Brewing Pack. Shell- oh, okay. We're gonna go you there, you there. We're gonna buy a bunch of these Grilling and Brewing Packs, so we can try and get... a Parrot. Okay, well, we didn't get a Parrot. Parrot, yes! Oh, two Parrots! Fantastic! Okay, raw crab meat can go over there. The lime, you put the lime in the coconut, I think, and then you just drink it all up. Okay, so now we are just waiting on uh, to be attacked. As soon as we get attacked, we can just give them a parrot, and they should be all good. And then I need some place to store the parrot, so I need an animal pen. How do I make that? Uh, animal pen. Two plank, two wood, iron bar, villager. Okay. Uh, if we're attacked at the start of the day, we can give them a parrot. And then we're good. Okay, so the next up is we need an archer. So we need rope, which means we need cotton. So where the heck do we find cotton? Uh, is it in this one? Cotton plant. Okay, so let's buy one of you. Cotton plant. Cotton. Hey, there we go. Cotton plant. Okay. The lumberjack can start work on the cotton plant. Seaweed can be sold. Banana can be stored. And then you three can kill that seagull. <laughs> Okay, I think we just need one cotton. Okay, perfect. We have one cotton. Okay, animal pen, which means I can store these parrots. Good. Oh, I've already got the plank and wood. What am I doing? 
<laughs> I brought it over with me. Okay, rope, plank, wood. Oh, no, no, no. I need to make this into... Where's my builder? Builder go there. Wait, how do I make this into rope? Hold on. Two cotton and a villager. Oh my god, I'm losing my mind. I need two cotton and one villager to make rope. Okay, two cotton, plank, and a wood. No, no, no. You go there first. Okay, rope, wood, plank. Now this will turn this villager into an archer. Okay, so this bow should turn this villager into an archer. Hey, train an archer! We got ranged as the achievement. Fantastic. That's very good. Okay. So now we just need to wait until we get attacked. Now this should happen at the next moon, I hope. So once this day is over, um, we will feed all of our villagers, and then we should get attacked by a pirate. Let's hope, because if I don't get attacked, then I need to do the whole day again. <laughs> okay, feed the villagers. Okay, very nice. I did not get attacked. Okay, well, let's start another day then. Jeez, okay. This is just the way that I found to make infinite food, is you just keep making... You keep having greenhouses that just make a banana tree. Then you just have a dude pick the banana tree. Basically just, it automates all the food so you don't need to worry. I don't know if it's intended to be that way, but... It's, uh, super easy. Okay, Ender Moon 146. Yes, I've been playing this game for 146 moons. Which is an extremely long amount of time. Two cards too many. Totally fine. I'll sell two bananas. Two of these rotting bananas. Okay, another moon. Come on. Just pirates, 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 pirates. Let's all say it. Pirates. You gotta be kidding me. Is there a way to trigger pirates? There's a- yeah, okay. There's a pirate card in the Archipelago pack. Archipelago? Arch Archipelago. Archipelago pack. That's a mouthful, jeez. Oh my god, stack together. Your na- your- The name of your game is Stacklands, and for some reason the shells don't stack. Okay, give me a pirate- there we go, first try. Iron deposit can be sold, sandstone and iron bar can be stored. So the pirate should take this parrot and just become friendly. Ooh. Friendly pirate! Yes! Okay, befriend a pirate. Friend with an eye patch. Alright, easy. Ooh. It has joined your side. His health sucks. Combat level 14, 10% four, chance to stun target. Alright, that's it. That's the game done. Why Ooh. on earth was I waiting for a pirate ship to spawn? I could have just... I could have just bought a pirate. Alright, thank you so much for watching. That is Stacklands. Hopefully they don't update this game and I have to come back, but we'll see. <laughs> thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode. If you didn't understand a single bit of this, that's totally fine. I just wanted to let you guys know that this game is now done and I don't have to come back. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Degrees Celsius today in Australia, which is very hot. Um, so if you see me taking a sip of ice cold water, don't blame me. Invite you to experience the menu. I'm so in. I can't wait. Show me, Ralph. Show me what you got. Please don't smoke. It'll kill your palate. And my palate. <laughs> Jesus. Thank you.